Hey everybody, I'm Lydia with Ruckert Real Estate and I have our owners, Brad and Tommy, on with us today. Say hey guys. Hello. Uh, and we just wanted to share a little bit about what we've been seeing in the market. Uh, so Brad, could you share a little bit about what you're seeing due to pandemic conditions and some of the behavior we're seeing out there? Yes, thank you. First, let's address the elephant in the room. Okay, so there is a pandemic going on and due to COVID-19, a lot of sellers have decided to postpone the move, which is okay and we respect that. And we'll still be in business to help you when we eventually all are safe to, to move forward in business. But right now, the sellers who decided to list because there's not a lot of inventory are being rewarded handsomely. And Tommy, I know we discussed a lot about this, but uh, do you wanna share some reasons behind that? Absolutely. Um, we were going into the normal spring market uh, we were already seeing historically low levels of inventory. Um, you know, we, right before right before COVID started to affect our marketplace, uh, we were off to a very early spring start. Low inventory, crazy buyer demand, and really great interest rates. And then when COVID happened, obviously the Feds had to even had to lower interest rates even further to keep the economy going. And then sellers, as Brett, to your point, were not going live to the market because they didn't know where they were going to go or there was just a level of uncertainty. Um, and they wanted to play it safe and not just allow strangers and carry bacteria and viruses into their house. Absolutely. And, and rightfully so. I think all of those things are valid concerns. Um, what we've figured out is that there are safe ways to go about doing this. And we engaged uh, very early on with folks in the uh, respiratory medical ICU to learn about safe ways to go about conducting showings. And we put those protocols in place early on and we've been able to uh, establish a level of confidence with our sellers and with our agents and clients uh, that there are safe ways to go about looking at property and, uh, and we put those in place. So again, the, the inventory issue has been insanely low and even worse now with COVID, and buyer demand is even higher because interest rates are lower and we're in our normal spring market and everybody's sitting around their computer with their eyes glued to the screen trying to find out what the next amazing house is for them. So conditions for sellers are incredible. Right, yeah. and so the state of Virginia has deemed uh, real estate to be essential. Suitable housing is essential. So we're still willing to work. And like Tommy said, we're gonna follow the CDC protocols. What we found most recently is that in all price ranges in Richmond, we are seeing a scarcity of inventory. So the sellers who decide to go live are being rewarded if they follow our game plan. Um, we recently listed a house down in Chesterfield. It's a 1,200 square foot rancher. Um, Lydia, do you want to pull the, the most recent showing report for us? Sure. Yep. Okay, so we listed this house on a Thursday. Uh, today's Friday. So we've now had 74 approved showings in the next 48 hours. And 29 showings got um, declined simply because we don't have room for them. So uh, the reason we show you this is because I've been selling real estate for 20 years. I've never seen that much demand on a property. Uh, we anticipate a bidding war um, and the seller will be rewarded for a listing right now. And hopefully um, other people can understand that there is a huge pent up in demand and there's a scarcity of inventory. So if you're considering selling your house, contact us because we want to help. Like Tommy said, there's a ways to do it safely. And then of course we have a proven game plan to net the best results. And it's not just um, Tommy, myself and Lydia, there's other members on our team that are committed to the process to making sure and we have other vendors that buy in too, to help our sellers um, reach the full potential. So if you want more details on this, you're, you're welcome to reach out to us. Um, Tommy or Lydia, do y'all want to close this? Yeah, I would also say that this is not isolated specifically to that price point in consecutive weeks in the past four weeks that we've put property on at multiple different price points we have seen not the demand of 70 you know to 74 showings and 30 30 declines because we don't have enough room in a couple of days to do it uh, but last week we had a higher price point about another hundred thousand heavier and we had 40 showings on that property uh, receive multiple offers. And then the week before that, we had a property in the $800,000 range, which got a considerable amount of showings and fantastic results for the sellers as well. So across all price points, um, the overarching theme is why wait for less money? Go now and, uh, and reap the rewards. Absolutely. Right? And I think the only thing I would add is we're seeing a lot of voices out there kind of trying to make predictions and share about what they're seeing. 
Um, and we wanted to add ours to it only because we have specific examples that we wanted to share about. And like Brad has, like he mentioned, we have never seen before. So the big thing is we just want to share the real life examples that we've been seeing in the last couple of weeks. So thanks for watching and thanks for always trusting Rucker Real Estate to give input on the market. And we hope to see you soon. Absolutely. Cheers, y'all.